In WIOA, the enormous amounts of paper seems to be the norm. Not only does the paper consume our time and create inefficiencies, it also costs money. However, by using technology and the full capabilities of Employee Florida Marketplace, we can eliminate much of the paper that we handle today. So let me show you how the use of the paperwork costs much more than the price of the paper. Oh hi, how often do we think about the paper that we use? The majority of us don't think about it. However, according to a Minnesota study, the average American office worker generates 10,000 sheets of paper. And in the WIOA world, it's more like 15,000 sheets of paper per year. Take this sheet of paper for example. By itself, it's only about three quarters of a cent. But once you print it, it's anywhere from five to seven cents per sheet. Take this color paper. Once you put that color ink on here, the sheet of paper increases to 25 cents. When you look at your office supply bill, all you see is the cost of the paper. What you don't see is the cost of the use of that paper. In fact, that same study by Minnesota Environmental Agency says that the cost of the use of the paper is anywhere from 13 to 31 times the cost to purchase the paper. So what adds to the cost of the paper? Let us look at the contributing factors. According to Price, Waterhouse, and Coopers, it costs $20 per employee to file these documents. An additional $120 to retrieve the documents, and if you happen to misfile or lose a document, it would cost you up to $300 to recreate. These costs begin to add up. One of these four-drawer four file cabinets, is average price is $250. A 150 gigabyte hard drive which costs $200 would store 70 of these file cabinets. As you can see, the price difference is a no-brainer. $17,500 for 70 of these or $200 for a 150 gigabyte hard drive. As you can see, the cost of the paper is only a fraction of the cost of using the paper. When you factor in costs like storage, printer and copier machines, printer and copier toners, filing and office supplies, postage, and employee time. That $38 that you spend on the price of the paper is actually costing your organization approximately $780 to use it. Other factors to consider are the impact to the environment. Paper and cardboard account for 35% of the waste in landfills. It takes 13 ounces of water to make just one sheet of paper. That's 570 gallons per case of paper. Of that 570 gallons, 90% of it is wastewater. And one tree only makes 16 reams of paper. That's a box and a half. Part of utilizing technology to our advantage in WIOA is creating forms that are easily filled out on the computer and then at the end of the form you have your electronic signature built into the PDF so that way the individual whether it's yourself or an applicant can sign electronically with a signature pad something as easy as this and then you're able to submit that form and upload it to the Employ Florida Marketplace under the document management you scan the document in or you upload the document and that eliminates any of the paperwork that you have to have in front of you to shuffle around. So I've shown you how the use of paper costs us much more than the cost of paper itself. And by utilizing the technology in the document management module within Employee Florida Marketplace, you can reduce, if not eliminate, paperwork that's associated with case management. This doesn't mean that we're going to eliminate paper completely from our daily lives, but what it does mean is that we become more efficient and more cost effective in the way we do business. We've talked about the cost of paper and the cost to use paper. Changing to a paperless environment requires an organization to change the culture. So take that step now to reduce costs by going paperless.